Hello everyone, Mike Rempel from Another Set of Eyes with today's Excel Bytes blog post. Today I'm going to respond to a question I recently received uh, regarding hidden cells and copying and pasting and uh, kind of a reverse approach to copying and pasting when you have hidden cells. So here we go and let's take a look. So here's our scenario. I just have numbers 1 through 10 and 100 through 1000 here. And originally I did a post on the keyboard shortcut Alt semicolon where you can uh, show visible cells only when you want to copy just those visible cells. And just to recap that, if I hid these rows here and I wanted to just copy one to 9 and 10, I couldn't just highlight this, hit copy, because when I went to paste it, it's going to copy and paste even the cells for the rows that are hidden. I'm going to hit Control Z to undo that. So what I need to do is highlight this area and hit my keyboard shortcut Alt semicolon, and notice it just activates just the visible cells, not the hidden ones. So now when I do a copy, notice the marquees are just going around those cells that are visible. Now when I go to paste those, I'm just copying and pasting the visible cells only, not those that were hidden. Okay? So now the question is though, let's say I have this data here from row 14 down to 23 and I just want to paste just what's visible. Now if I highlight this list of cells here, I copy it, go up to J1 and hit paste, it looks like it just pasted rows 1, 2, 9, and 10, but if I unhide those rows, you'll see that it pasted everything. What if I just wanted to paste just the data for 1, 2, 9, and 10. Well, I'm going to do uh, the, uh, I'm going to hit undo twice now. And I think the, the probably the simplest way is to use a option that Excel has called skip blanks. So in this case, if I just want to copy and paste 100, 200, 900, and 1000 over an area that has hidden rows, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to remove those cells there. And if I highlight those cells, copy them, and go to the area I want to paste it, and then use my keyboard shortcut Control-Alt-V, and choose now Skip Blanks, and say OK, it looks like very similar to what we just had before, but if I unhide those rows, you'll see it just pasted what was visible and it skipped over the blanks that I had in the area that I copied and only pasted the areas that were visible because I had removed the cells out of the areas that were hidden. And hopefully that's useful to you if you ever have a situation where you need to paste only certain areas that are visible but don't want to do it in small chunks. So hopefully that's useful to you. Thanks for stopping by. If you'd like to see more, please feel free to go to my website, excel-bytes.com, and I hope you subscribe. Happy excelling.